So what are we looking at? <laughs> so uh, we are looking at a two wheel balancing robot that tries and balance itself on two wheels using uh, rate gyros and accelerometers. Okay, and we, at the top, what we got a camera? Is yeah, right? we got a camera over here which is okay. used to detect a red flag. Okay. And stops in case it detects one. Okay. And uh, then we have a wireless uh, PCB down there. Which okay. Is a TI PCB. Okay. Wireless transmits data to the VX work for crunching the numbers that we get from uh, the rate gyros and accelerometers. So serial protocol or what kind of what it's what a, kind of protocol of wireless? It's right. Nine uh, fifteen megahertz of wireless uh, data communication. Right. I uh, understood, but what kind of data are you transmitting over it? Right now it's 175 kbps. Okay, and then how do you interface to it on the, uh, uh, over here? It's what's, just a what's standard UART. Right, so it is serial. So here is the same replica ah. of the wireless okay. module. It receives the okay. data and it sends Goes the wireless, serial uh, cable here UART. and into the target. Yeah. So, so UART over with an RF link Yeah. between. Okay, got it. And uh, then we've got some motors on the bottom. Yeah. Yep. So and we some motor controllers here, Pololu uh, DC motors. Okay. And the motor controllers are driven by this board. This just generates the PWM as received from VXWorks. Okay. And the PWM drives these accordingly. So these are uh, off the shelf motor controllers, off the shelf yeah. RF units. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, you're designed to integrate them like this yes. with the motors. Yes. And uh, you selected these motors, uh, or, the, or were they designed for these controllers? Oh, I'm sorry, about that. The, the motors that you selected, did you uh -huh. select them, or were they? did they come as a package no. with the motor no, controller? No, we selected each of the parts individually. Okay. Like the right, and then put it to together. Match the motors. Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. great. Um, so I think we've seen everything. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, how much does this thing weigh? How much are we so talking about? We actually have. Haven't we waited. We yeah. haven't. We have changed weight like yeah. few days back. We have yeah, added, added, added some. These batteries yeah. are just like a dummy, just a weight actually. Additional sure. Weight. Yeah, yeah, extra weight. Okay. Just to polarize the mass. Okay. Make it more stable. Okay. So. Yeah. So you're shifting the center of gravity mm -hmm. higher. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We'll talk about that more later. <laughs> but let's see it in action. Okay, so, so it's kind of unstable at times, but if, uh, sometimes it works, sometimes like so there it's depends kind of where it starts out, huh? Yeah. 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 And every time we turn it on, we have to tune the PID terms actually. So, so. that's a kind of okay. So you have um, to like uh, keep it. Uh, if you if you just keep like a light finger on top of it, then the loop, uh, the PID loop works just fine. You can you know <laughs> you can move actually it around okay. and you know I mean you can. So if you had some dampening, yes, yeah. probably. Yeah. Just I mean, some something is missing from the controller, you know. Yeah. Yes, but, I mean, so, so can I try keeping the light yeah, finger? Yeah, sure, sure. Let's see if I can film it. Andy at the same okay. time. You can okay. Just grab it from here. Right? Okay. Okay. Yeah. And you can move it around. Touching is believing. Yeah, you can move it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's just a um, feather touch. If it's right. just move, yeah, oh? take it further. It's trying to come at me. <laughs> okay, I lost it. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. No, that that's good. That's what you're saying. And uh, we can so, check the red flag so now. It, it, it maintains control for yeah. seconds yeah. without yeah. Uh, any kind of dampening. With dampening, it does better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like so more the weight actually it will help. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. And it all depends on tuning actually. PID yeah, tuning. I mean, yeah. we, we can't figure out the right tuning. We'll, we'll talk more about that right now. Yeah, we just want to see how it works. Okay, so sure. yeah. The red, red. Red. So sure. here's the next thing. If, it, if you get a okay. red flag. So it sees a flag so detected. So we've got okay. the flag detector over there. Okay. So all right. And, 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 and we've got, so we've got the NTSC coming back here as well. Yes. Going back to the uh, frame grabber yes. over here. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Got it. Anything else? And and there's uh, the uh, RF the, receiver. Yeah. So the blinking LED itself says that it's uh, transmitting and receiving data. Okay. So when you actually turn it on, you can want to turn it on. Uh, you have to reset. Yeah. <laughs> so you can see there is uh, right 
there. Something got reset. I see. Right, right, right. So there's like two different LEDs turning on. One yeah. is for transmitting, one is for reception. Okay. The green so is for reception and the red means mm -hmm. it's transmitting some data. So if I just turn off this module, it stops receiving any packets from this. Thing. Okay. And then you said this was uh, purchased directly from Texas Instruments? Oh, uh, right? yeah. It's a kind of uh, evaluation module. Yeah. Okay. I see. So right, you can right. directly uh, prototype anything. Uh, okay. Like quick start. Okay. All right. Well, thank you very much. I think that's, is it, unless there's anything else to see. Uh, no, that's pretty much that's it. That's pretty much it. Yeah. All right.